Shaji, stay with a G. Okay, okay, like the Papa Pay song, it was cool, like that's something I could listen to again. And then uh, the E Naughty song, I ain't fuck with. The new Wave song is obviously fire. I was like, okay, I'm waiting for that next hit that I fuck with. This is it. This is it. This is it. Consistency, bro. Like again, I always say this because Shaji was one of them rappers that never really dropped consistently. He was every one to two months he would drop. Now it's like, bro, it's like the fourth song in like the last month he's dropped. He's been going crazy, bro. <laughs> He did not say fuck. He said fuck copy, I think. He didn't say copy. Because <laughs> I think Yushi said the same shit. Now everybody reversing the V. Alright. Right. But he's saying copy. Okay, okay. He died in a car crash. Nice. Nice. I'm not going to just beat this anybody, bro. I understand because there's other people that die in car crashes that get this, but it's like, bro. This shit crazy. Convy was panicking. I'm going to fuck a con flock. Fuck you panicking. Where's this video at? Cause this like a this don't look like New York for real. Is it? They in LA? Alright. That's what I thought. I don't want to sound stupid. This is Cali with Sha signed the deal. It's fire, bro. Oh, he did do the no jumper interview. I seen that. Happy for Shazis, bro. Another guy that like been rapping, been doing his thing, was really. Doing this shit for a long ass time, bro. When did Took My Shit Part 1 come out? That was like 20... That was 2020, wasn't it? Or at the beginning of 2021? Regardless of the fact, bro, Shaji's waited his turn, and he finally there. Yo. He did this shit with no hope, too. He had no big feature, no nothing. He just him. He ain't get put on by his man, there's nothing. That's a fact. He really waited his turn. All it really took was that one TikTok song. That one TikTok hit. Got him a deal. Getting up millions of views. Hundreds of thousands of millions of views. It's crazy, bro. I know he's technically bigger than him, but I feel like he... Shot the face of the YGs. Who from Brooklyn said that? I, th I he, they didn't say that specifically. I think, I think it was one of the GDs. Or no, it was Famo. I think it was Famo Binga. He said, um, Shah G's took K Flock's spot. He had the spotlight on him right now. That's a fact. 